hi guys today is friday and it is currently 7 50 and i'm going to take you guys through a day in my life so while i'm getting ready i'm going to give you guys a story time and maybe a pep talk so when i was in secondary school i i never felt like you know one of the pretty girls or i never felt like i was one of the you know top girls now like i mean i was one of the top girls when it came to academic stuff like i was always top three ever since i was in junior school and um anytime they mentioned the list of you know pretty girls in the class and stuff like that because you know secondary school now you, you obviously talk about that kind of stuff so um they never mentioned my name so at a point i started getting insecure like there was a time i told my dad about it and he was like people with big heads are it never told me that i don't have a big head he told me that um that people with big heads are smart so i'm a smart person <laughs> it never tried to convince me that my head was small and i actually understand him now like he did not want me to just like believe a lie he gets so yeah secondary school was it was actually like calm and all that but when it came to being like insecure that was like a lot for me and um i i was able to like overcome it i think it was just last year that i was able to overcome it um well, just last year i was able to overcome it people would tell me like audio people would tell me oh my god you're so pretty i was trying to say thank you but i did not believe it like i just thought they're trying to like get on my good side or something like that but i was never rated amongst the pretty girls in school so yeah you know there's this standard of beauty that it's that is currently like there's this standard of beauty in the world now that if you if you don't fit into that spec that standard then you're not pretty that's what people say now like if you don't look like this this type of girl if you don't look like this this um kind of girls like you're not you're not one of them you're not pretty a lot of people say but i'm here to tell you today that you should make your own standard you should make your own standard in fact you are a standard on your own some people might not look like you might not look like them but that does not make that, that does not make you less beautiful. It does not make you less pretty. Just because you have a big head and others don't have a big head does not mean that they are prettier than you. It does not mean you are they does not mean that you are more masculine than them. Just because you have broad shoulders like me does not make you masculine. It does not make you less feminine than other girls than that other girls that don't have broad shoulders. Like this is how God created you and me. This is how um this is the kind of perfect image that god has created for us you get so i've learned to embrace it i've learned to um i've learned to understand i've learned to understand that i am my own standard okay i'm a standard for girls with big head and broad shoulders <laughs> I'm a standard for for girls that don't th that think that they don't fit into the standard, the general world standard. I don't even know what I'm saying, but I feel like people don't get me, get me, you get. So that's my little rant. That's my little motivational session. I'm still doing my skincare. This is the sunscreen I use, and if you want to get this kind of sunscreen. You should get it from your skin's best bestie, your skin's bestie underscore, I think, on Instagram. The girl's name is Serena and she is very, very reliable. She can deliver to you anywhere in the world. I'm going to tag her. I'm going to tag her handle on the screen. In case anybody wants to know why I'm going for the election, it's because I'm running for a post. <laughs> I'm running for a sports director for my department. I know huge step like am i not okay with the stress i'm already going through yes i'm tired of the stress but 
or does like it will not hurt me you know it's not a big deal just to organize sports events and all like it's not hard <laughs> so yeah i just i just made my manifesto yesterday night i just you know did a little um, work on it just it's not hard you'll see the clips when i get there so yeah I think the sunscreen is all blended. Ah, no. <laughs> okay, good to go. So, you guys just found out that Moses' place is out of the market. Like, and Lara is obsessed with him. <laughs> He's obsessed with Moses' place. Yes, sir. And it's off the market. It yeah. Off the market. Period. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, I will be crushing on him. Eh, Lara? I will be crushing on him. It's my crush. <laughs> I'm him. So you guys were on our way to the faculty for the election. Um, this is my friend Lara. Lara is running for welfare director. Say hi to the vlog. Hi. And Uzube is running for president. <laughs> so yeah. See you guys there. I just invited us to the faculty fellowship and I told the guy that I'm going somewhere. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, 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 oh. What's looking so crumbly? Oh my god. Her. <laughs> Let's go. Just sleep. You guys saw that I was the only one on the sports director, Kini. That's because nobody can compete with me. Okay? They cannot compete with me. They know that we'll obviously win. So nobody came up and said, "Oh, I was supposed to run for sports director." Nobody. You guys should ignore the noise. It's because they're having fellowship meeting or something like that upstairs. So yeah, this is my friend Lara. Lara, say hi. Ah, uh, I said say hi. hi. <laughs> So you guys, I just had a much needed two hour power nap and I am off to the basketball court. I am on board and marker duty. You know, I have to write down the scores and stuff like that. So I'm off to the court. Um, tomorrow is my own game. So today I'm just watching the guys. Then the girls are playing tomorrow and then some guys also play tomorrow too. But my game is tomorrow, Sha. So, so yeah. I'm going to be filming a few. I'm going to be filming a few TikToks so that um i'm also consistent on my other social media platforms so yeah see you guys soon hey guys the time is currently 4 13 and the game was supposed to start four o'clock and there is an african time oh why are you making noise now you guys these guys are using african time for us the game was supposed to start four o'clock on the dot and now it is currently 4 13 and the is still looking empty as you can see you guys this is 4 43 and game has not so started <laughs> You guys are with the girlies. I'm going to get food, our dinner. Say hi. hi. What's up? <laughs> Bye guys, mwah! <laughs>